course, we are getting better, as we said. And the only thing is that um, I think we, you get what you deserve at the end. I think we can say maybe we, we had a great game, but you have to win the games. And we have to learn to do that. But I can only say that I'm proud of our guys. I think they, they had a great performance, great game. We, wa we wanted to win until the end. We tried hard. We, was cl we were close. So every, all we can say now is that we have to keep this spirit and keep on, uh, continue to improve and believe. Pano, it seemed like uh, David and Kennedy were very deliberate, uh, especially in the first half, but throughout the game, in trying to link up and connect with each other uh, to try to generate some chances. And obviously, it, it resulted in the goal in the first half. Uh, was that kind of a plan coming in, or was it more a case of just them both finally being on the on the pitch at the same time and being able to to work together? Yes, it, of course, it's a part of the plan. They, I think, what we are looking for is to have associations in a team, and they are two, uh, two of them. They work very, very good together. We can see, we could see that in the first game when David was was fit. In the second game, also until we we had uh, um, eleven guys on on the field, and since then David was injured. But it, David is very important, but also not only because of his individual quality, because how. He improves uh, our team and how our team also feels better on the field and offensively with more more potential. So uh, on that side, I think we have to improve more more associations between our guys where we can connect better, we can we can create and and be more dangerous. and And I believe that that's again process, working hard and believing. Uh, was there anything wrong with uh, Ramos? Is that more of a tactical sub or? Yeah, no. Ramos had a. I don't know if uh, if if it's a concussion at this point, but he was uh, he wasn't he he has to to go outside. I think he was uh, in that tackle that he had um, before when he got the yellow card. I think uh, he 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 got uh, injured there. So the first thing I did was to go inside and see to check with him how he feels. He he was a little bit concerned about his uh, his vision, but now I think he's he's fine. So we'll see. I don't. I, I can't tell you the uh, medical report on, on him yet. Pano, uh, you you changed things up in the in the midfield with Matt, Razvan, and Mira. Uh, what was your thinking behind that? Uh, well, we start with three uh, midfielders who are very good in 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 three, three uh, holding midfielders. Our idea was to to close the uh, passes through, uh, especially. To in, in the first half with McInerney, with, with with Milano and Asprilla, all those guys they play very narrow, so we wanted to close that space in front of our defense, and I think we did. Guys did great. So in the second half, as they got tired, we had to uh, do some changes, and it also worked very well. So we are very happy. I think we have uh, resources. We have a very good team, very good guys who work hard. They believe. They understand game plan. I think uh, went very well. It, it was just that we, we needed to score that second goal, which was uh, very important for us. But again, like we always said, we are building the momentum. We were close to, to win this game today, and uh, we are happy with the performance.